Hello everybody and what is going on? This is Justin Starcher with a follow-up video from this morning. As we all know, if you watched earlier today or watched last night, actually I didn't uh, disclose it last night, but I did put out there this morning that today was going to be my first day as a Uber driver using the Uber app and uh, doing ride share, giving people, uh, you know, rides to work, um, home from the bar, the club, to the airport, whatever. So, it's story time. Let me uh, tell everybody how my day went. First, um, I woke up this morning probably around 8 o'clock. Um, got stuff situated here. Actually made my video around 9 o'clock. I think it was actually 9.18 or something like that. After the video, I tightened up a few more things, and then I left. I went straight to the gas station. I got gas. Then I went to the car wash, and I had my car washed. So after that, I was all situated. I went and found me a spot where I was going to camp out and wait for my first pickup. Okay. So... Needless to say, I've had this phone probably for 45 days, 30 days, something like that, trying to be proactive, trying to get everything taken care of. So when it was time for me to do it, I could go ahead and do it. So I fire up the phone, and the phone tells me that I am not activated. Well, okay. So I back out, and I try it again. Not activated. Well, I go into the settings and I try to find the uh, the partner section or whatever so I can get some help. And evidently, with my uh, experiences with uh, you know technology, I couldn't find it. So I came back home, which is about was about ten minutes out, and uh, I emailed them. Within about five minutes, they got back to me and. They told me that um, evidently on my last trip something was wrong, so just to, you know, try it again. So I emailed them back and told them, hey, I haven't taken any trips yet. This is my first trip or my first time really using it. And uh, evidently, to make a long story short, there was actually a user agreement that I had hadn't – there was a new one from the time that I had signed up that I needed to uh, check off on and uh, approve of their uh, terms. So they finally sent that to me. And um, of course I checked off on it and I was good to go. So after going back and forth with emails, getting that all taken care of, it was honestly about four o'clock. And I was like, I, honestly, I felt defeated. I felt like today was gonna be a really, really good day. And I, you know, I was like, oh, if I can't get online, what am I going to do? So it was four o'clock and I was deciding, okay, well, let me give it a shot. I said, you know, I'm not doing anything. I don't have to work till tomorrow. Let me just try and see what I can do. Never done it before. Never used it before. Very first time today. Actually, um, when I first got the phone, I played around with it for about, a couple hours just to get the nuances of uh, all the buttons and all that stuff. So we're at three minutes and uh, 50 seconds. I know we're running a little bit long here. We're going to try to keep it under six. Um, so where were we at? Okay. So I'm in my driveway. I'm getting stuff situated, making sure my car is straight before I start, make sure everything's cleaned up. I'm ready to go. Got my tight Father's Day shirt on. And I hit the button. Go one line. Blue button. Everybody knows it that uses Uber. Go online. I hit it, and I'm sitting in the driveway waiting for the cars so I can, uh, you know, turn out and go back to where I was at earlier. Well, before I got out of the driveway, I got a hit. I got a ping. And the ping was, I live in Williamsburg, Virginia. It was kind of heading east about uh, 10 to 15 miles uh, for a pickup, which I was like, all right, you know what? That's a long ways for a pickup, but I've never done it before. Let me go ahead and get the first time out of the way. So I, I went ahead and accepted the trip. I hit accept trip and I started on my destination. Evidently somewhere along the way, 
I hit the wrong button and and said that I was already there and I was still in my driveway. So I went ahead, pulled my GPS out, I had the address, and I headed on my way. Fifteen minutes later, I got there, and the uh, the passenger was super, super nice. I explained the situation, told her what was going on, told her it was my first time, and um, she was a business woman, business lady, just got back from, uh, I don't know, a meeting of some sort, and needed to uh, go to... Richmond Airport, and I was in in between Williamsburg and Newport News, and it was probably close to 50 miles to the airport. I'm like, wow, is my first trip really going to be a 50 mile, or I think it was 47 mile run. So, you know, I helped her with the bags, put her bags in the trunk, uh, asked her if she needed anything, asked her if she needed anything to drink. Uh, she declined. I asked her if she, uh, you know, needed, you know, certain radio station you know, anything that I could, you know, help her out with. She was like, no, she's like, I just kind of need to get there quick. My flight leaves in a such and such amount of time. So I just need to kind of get there. And I was like, all right, not a problem. She was, uh, as I would say, uber nice. And, uh, you know, she pretty much talked to me the whole way up there. She, um, you know, told me she uses Uber a lot. She really, she really enjoys it. And, um, you know, we went on our way 47, 50 minutes later. I arrived, dropped her off at the airport. Everything was good. She gave me a five-star rating, which was awesome. And, um, you know, just to kind of show everybody that I wasn't, you know, that you can do this. And I was actually online for a matter of minutes before I got a passenger pickup, before I got a ping. And I was, it took me... About 15 minutes to get her, and then it took us about, I think it was, I don't know, 45 minutes, 47 minutes to, um, I think it was 47 miles there, and it took me uh, 50 minutes to get there. So just to show everybody what my first trip was, and it was all of a matter of about an hour and a half, me picking her up, me getting her there, and I do count me coming back home. It was about an hour and a half. But if you can see it, and I'll try to wait till it uh, zooms. I had one trip today, as you can see on the map, from Williamsburg to Richmond. It happened at 419, and the total fare was $50.84. And that's not going to happen all the time, guys. Um, I, I think honestly, somebody uh, up upstairs was looking out for me. Told, it knew I was having a rough day. Wanted to give me a helping hand, and uh, and it could also go towards my uh, perseverance for not quitting, not stopping, just keep on digging, and uh, you know doing what I'm doing. You know. So in about an hour and a half, it was fifty dollars eighty four cents. As most people know out here, um, it is an eighty twenty split. I receive 80%, Uber receives 20%, but I'm also on the $10 a uh, $10 a week um, usage plan for uh, using their phone. So, um, guys and gals, you can do this. Um, I'm going to hit it tomorrow before I go to work. I'm hoping to get a couple of fares tomorrow, maybe make, make another extra $50 before I can go into work. So... This has gone on way too long. It's 8.58. Um, as you know, my name is Justin Starcher. You can hit me up on uh, Facebook, Justin Starcher, or um, you can catch me on my YouTube channel, which you've already seen because you're already here, and that's uh, Justin Starcher, which is J-U-S-T-I-N-S-T-A-R-C-H-E-R. Um, I will be making more videos about driving with the Uber app, ride share, um, selling on eBay, and what it all comes down to is making extra money. So have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.